The wild scene unfolded in broad daylight at the corner of Broadway and 169th Street in Washington Heights. Police officers repeatedly kick and strike two people that were resisting arrest with batons. At the beginning of the video, this officer takes out his baton and swings it at one of the two individuals. That's when chaos ensues. While one of the individuals is on the ground, two detectives and an off-duty officer appear in order to help with the arrest. If people are on the ground uh, and yet there's still um, physical action being taken, that concerns me. According to police, the two are a known nuisance in the neighborhood. They were asked to leave a subway stop after riders complained that the duo was harassing people and smoking on the stairs leading to the subway platform. When they refused, the officers tried to place them under arrest, but they fled out into the street. In a statement, PBA President Pat Lynch said in part, what the video doesn't show is that these perps, one of whom has been previously arrested for assaulting a police officer, threw a haymaker at the cops once they got above ground, necessitating the use of force to bring them into custody. 36-year-old Aaron Grissom and 37-year-old Sidney Williams face an array of charges, including felony assault on a police officer, resisting arrest and disorderly conduct. Some residents feel the officers went too far. There's sometimes you just got to do what you have to do, but you can't go overboard with these people. There's a lot of people here. Now, the NYPD is telling us that two of the officers were actually injured and sent to the hospital. The NYPD is also calling these two individuals career criminals. Both of them have over 30 arrests combined. We're live in Washington Heights. I'm Cristian Benavides, PIX11 News.